What's good, YouTube? We're talking college sports in the Deep South where college football is king. And on the plains of Auburn, the battle cry is War Eagle. Once again, it's Kennard Vernon Stewart here for Vernon Speak Sports Auburn with a little breaking news on some recruiting uh, outcomes for the Auburn Tigers. Looks like Auburn has cashed in on uh, Xavion Capers out of Denmark High School in Alpharetta, Georgia. He is a four star, a high end four star recruit at the receiver position. Now, if we think about this, just a couple of months ago, there was a lot of anxiety as far as this recruiting class for the Auburn Tigers because they were just as low as uh, probably about 30. But then Big Cat weekend rolls around. You get a lot of offensive line recruits that Auburn definitely needed. Uh, looks like Auburn is loading up with the wide receivers. And then when you think about loading up with wide receivers, you know, you got to learn your lesson. You know, Auburn had a lot of stock, you know, in George Pickens, but George Pickens winds up flipping at the last minute for the Auburn Tigers to the Georgia Bulldogs. Well, when we look at Xavion Capers, I mean, you know, he's a very, very gifted athlete, 6'3", 200-plus uh, pounds. The one thing that I notice about him that I'm very impressed with is the fact that he's such a big guy and he's able to create very athletic separation from the opposition. Very hard to do as a big guy. And he has great hands. He has, you know, in really, really close proximity type situation, especially on the uh, sideline, he's able to navigate his way to the football. So I think this is a very gifted athlete. I think this is a very good get for the Auburn Tigers. Um, hopefully, the commitment will be sustained. And usually the way that will be sustained if, you know, great outcomes from the Auburn Tigers. And I will go out on a limb and say that Auburn is probably getting a lot of these receiver recruits because they actually have some quarterbacks that can get them the ball. You know, you look at Bo Nix and you look at Joey Gatewood, these are guys that can potentially get them the ball, you know, that have some type of promise long term, even in the passing game, even though Gus Malzahn likes to run the run pass option. But you look at 2010, Auburn put a quarterback first pick of the NFL draft in a run pass option type offense. So, I mean, you know, there's your argument right there. So. You know, we look at Xavion Capers, a very gifted athlete, a great uh, get for the Auburn Tigers going into the offseason, the dead period, as we get ready for fall camps, getting ready for the uh, 2019 season. You know, it, it's just a really, really good turnaround for the Auburn Tigers, considering the where they were, say, in mid-May or even late April. As far as recruiting goes, a lot of people are like, man, this, you know, the sky's really... Uh, falling here in Auburn, but now with getting quality players in this mix, recru recruiting-wise, a winning record will only continue to solidify. Now, a lot of these guys are going into their junior year. You got to look at this. The stars can improve. Let's just say these guys have some breakout years. Let's just say a guy like, uh, you know, some of the guys that, that Auburn has had in this particular recruiting class, if, you know, they have some, you know, some breakout seasons, say Xavion Peters for, I mean, uh, Capers, for example, he has a breakout season. This 94, 76% can turn into 99, you know, whatever percent to make this guy a five-star recruit. So the rankings don't quit. That's where they are as of now. But a breakout season, you know, this year could, you know, really, really add value to their recruiting status. All right, guys, once again, it's Kennard Vernon Stewart for uh, Vernon Speaks Sports Auburn. We're talking to Auburn football like it's nobody's business, breaking news as, you know, Auburn gains another commitment in the 2020 class with Zevion Capers out of Alpharetta, Georgia. Auburn has a huge knack of recruiting guys out of uh, Georgia especially. Go ahead and like this video, subscribe, and comment.
As always, it's great to be an Auburn Tiger War Eagle.